just going to say morning but it's not this afternoon. So guys I took the morning off and uh, just been watching YouTube and TV and updating iPad and all that good stuff and learning about the phone. Uh, what I'm going to do now is finish doing what I have to do in here which is my last little part. I'm um, sorry just turning over addresses. So I've only got this pile, it's not bad, you can see, um, and there's a bunch in the envelope. Oh, some of the pictures from the band. With Pete was working in here till 2 this morning, and uh, we're setting up, I forgot Comes what comes with the school in the fall is we have to do all the team pictures and everything else. Um, looks like we're going to be running the yearbook this year, not 100% sure. They were going to put it out one more time to see if they could get an advisor. Um, there's no takers at this point so. so anyway we offered to take it on or help out or do what we could do which um, I think we're totally nuts but you know Pete's in charge of all the pictures for the yearbook and it might be one way that we get to find out what the heck is going on anyway guys I'm gonna go do what I have to do now and then we're going to my sister-in-law's later around 6 30 for my niece's Birthday little celebration. It's pizza over at Consumers again. I'm not sure if he's there tomorrow. Tomorrow is the day they come and put that blasted tank in. Um, I dread it. I dread anyone being here. I'm kind of hoping Pete is here. There's the tank outside my window. The temporary that has been here since June. It was supposed to be replaced in June. We had a nasty oil leak in May around Mother's Day weekend and um, it was wicked. The whole house stank of oil for days and all the oil that we had paid good money, which is about 700 and something dollars a month, ended up spilling into the garage. So, yeah. Well, they say don't cry over spilt milk, don't cry over spilt, spilt oil. There was a lot of oil and it reeked. Anyway, so yeah, they were supposed to come in June and fix it suddenly they lost the paperwork or they blamed it on the town the town blamed it on them because you have to have the town official building inspector come out make sure it's done correctly they rescheduled us for two days before we went to england i said absolutely not you guys are insane um because god forbid anything had happened while we were away and it was leaking or something else you know no one would have been here to tell them and then you got the whole environmental problem with oil getting into the ground and all that yucky stuff so anyway it's now September they're coming tomorrow um, better to get it done before and oh and, and I laugh because the company says we want our tank back yeah well we want our new tank installed they go well it was only temporary well if you hadn't lost the papers in the first place mate you could have had your tank back by June but no ramble 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 blah 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 Alright guys, let me go do what i got to do and um, I will touch base with you shortly. I hope everyone's having a great Thursday and um, it's another beautiful day in the neighbourhood. Talk to you later. Bye. Okay, now I'm all set. Phone, piping hot cup of tea and Elaine on YouTube. Talk to you later guys. Bye. Dun 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 dun. Roxy, where do you want to go? Is Ash going to take you on the outside? Who goes, wait, wait, break the word down, and I understand. Let me stretch, pretend like I don't care, take a walk over to the kid, moon everybody on the camera. <laughs> that was attractive, Lou. It's like I know you're up to something. He goes, big boy. me. Oh, yes, there's the magic word. <laughs> guys, how you doing? It is, I don't know, it is 25 past 3. Just finished what I was doing in the office. There's the six neat piles, three in the box, three on top. Um, just catching up on a bit of Emmerdale. I was just watching it on here while I was stapling those orders together. And um, I just want to finish watching this episode, then I'm going to go upstairs and relax my back for a while before we go to my niece's birthday. I have my friends here because I just bought myself a little tiny bag of cheese and onion in here. 
Louis is going to act like he doesn't care and then Roxy's going to make sure she gets any crumb that falls. Right, Roxy? Watch this. She does not listen. Roxy, sit. Sit. Nope. I'm just going to jump up. That's the opposite. That's the opposite, missus. Anyway, I'm going to finish watching Emmerdale, then I'm going to go upstairs for a bit. Oh, and I want to try and get some laundry done because the guys will be working down in the basement tomorrow and in the garage putting in that tank. So I'd like to get my laundry done today if possible. So I hope you're doing well, guys, and I'll talk to you in a bit. Bye. So we're going to my niece's now for her birthday. It's rush, 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 isn't it? Yeah. That jacket looks really nice. Turn around, then. Hope you have. <laughs> yeah. Very nice. You look good. So let's see what the makeup is today. <laughs> Same as every day. Let's have a look. Oh, you didn't do your book thing. What was one of the things in the book? Rip the spine. Or break the spine. Oh, you don't want to break the spine on the book already. I did it. You did? It's one of them. You did it already? Yeah. You're supposed to do it on camera. Sorry. No, you... Show the crease on it. You committed yesterday. Where is it? Upstairs. What else was in there? The one that says duct tape. They're right on the edges of the book. Alright, tomorrow you have to do two on camera. Okay? Yeah. It's the birthday girl. Actually, no need to fix your hair. And there's the cousin. <laughs> Stop doing it. Takes a while. Oh, I'm recording again. I think Walker's going to fit. I said, let's like see. You got it upside down. Yeah. Hard to turn. So she see, said, this, this is way more important than coming to interviews, but I already got hers. Instead of the 17 inch. Did you? Over one. I said, you need to take your knife. I know that makes me. But then I'm looking at it and I'm going, I mean, it's no, really I off the wall. Like okay. Right, they didn't push the wall back. Really they didn't push the wall back. So I'm thinking, maybe we'll get the yeah. smaller yeah. toilet. Wait, let's start over again. Yeah. Happy yeah. birthday, yeah. dear Pinkery. Yeah. Happy yeah. birthday yeah. to yeah. you. You smell like I'm wrong. You gotta come over here. Yeah. Uh, First yeah. off, you're not upside down. Not yet. Uh, it's going this. It's going this. Good luck. It's on. Okay, there you go. <laughs> okay, can I blow them out now? Make a wish. No, Make a wish. no you gotta wait. You gotta wait until they burn down. Go ahead. <laughs> ah. What? <laughs> All of a sudden, she's 11 and she can't blow out candles? Aim! Get in there. Enjoy everything. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was painful. Oh my god. It's hard <laughs> getting old, isn't it? My birthday party. <laughs> Did mommy has embarrassed you? Just for, wait, should I read it out loud? Yes. Yeah, why not? Just for you, you need stickers. Speaking of today, curling. Oh, thank you for the Crazy stickers. Girl. Good girl. Hi, cousin. Hi. Oh. <laughs> Hi. Two pigs. Hence me running late. Hope your birthday is frosted on the That's outside really. and happy on really? the inside. Mm -hmm. Happy Aww. birthday. I love Ashley. Ashley, a.k.a. Cool. best cousin in the world. All right. Busy, busy, no huh? truer statement has ever. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> I need a picture. <coughs> that's gonna yeah, be your city. That is so in this city. Well, you stretch it out. I don't want you to stretch it. Hey, Paige. Smile. Smile. She's got him. Oh, he's still there? Yes. Oh, okay, that's cute. Did you have him? What year did he say? Because Pete doesn't remember him. I'm just leaving my nieces. It's dark. I'm gonna go grab some food. 8.08. I'm trying to get the moon, but it's kind of hiding. Looks like a light. Yeah. It's quite big. Yeah. There it is. Oh, oh don't move. Sorry. Don't move. Oh. I wanna get a picture with the flag, but I can't. My kitties, getting my... Oh. Hey guys, hope you're doing well. It's five to nine. Just had something to eat and got back. Just came back from my nieces and I grabbed a burger from McDonald's on the way home. Just ate that. So I just... I said, when I, I laugh because I say, oh, I just ran up the stairs. Not a run at all, but been up and down the stairs twice in the last five minutes. I'm a bit winded. Um, just catching up on a little bit of Coronation Street off of YouTube, learning th things about Haley that I didn't even know had happened in the past, so it's kind of funny to watch, because I haven't, 
had a big gap with Coronation Street obviously when I left England never watched it until this year when I found it on YouTube why you need to know that I have no idea I'm just waffling Ashley left my nieces and went over to her boyfriend's and Pete's in his office now doing some more editing and just informed me that he will be gone all weekend he has a soccer game a football game and the band on Saturday so I think I'm definitely going to go with him to the band competition because Saturday morning I have that meeting from 9 to 6 at uh, 9 to 6 9 to 3 the training and then Sunday I don't know I'll just be around here because I don't know if Ash is working but Pete's working all day so if Ash isn't working well, I'll probably see if she wants to go do something uh, maybe go start some Christmas shopping. I want to try and start early this year because I'm the kind of person that starts the second week in December and I refuse to do that this year. I, I'm not going to have it left till the last minute. But anyway, that's the weekend. It's still got Friday to come. We're going to get up bright and early tomorrow. Pete is going into work so I want to make sure I'm up and ready early because I'm not sure what time the guys are coming to start working on the tank. Fingers crossed that goes well and there's no hassles with it. I'd rather Pete be here, but I know if he's, whew, if he's got a chance to go work, that's better. Um, my niece tomorrow night is going for her black belt. Um, so we were just told we can go watch, but I don't know. Pete's got a, um, he's going to leave work and then go right over to a swim meet and get the, the uh, high school team at their swim meet. He's going to do some pictures of that, which we didn't do last year. Didn't even know they had a swim team. Ash is off tomorrow, but she'll be hanging out. She's got plans, and Saturday she's now off work. They called and cancelled her today. Well, they asked. It was so nice. The message on the machine was, would you mind? I guess they overstaffed, and uh, she has a lot of hours coming up. She had like six days in a row. So they said, would you mind taking the day off? <laughs> she's like, no, I'll do it. Anyway, on that note, guys, I'm going to love and leave you for tonight. Um, that's Thursday done and dusted and we'll see you tomorrow which is Friday bye guys have a great one see you tomorrow